Good morning. We're on the side of the road. It's uh, this dirt's a little uh, softer than I thought. We're outside uh, Palouse, uh, Washington, and uh, today we got a pretty solid day of driving. But I just want to show you guys my parking spot. Last night I tried to show it off, but uh, it was a little bit too dark. The Milky Way was out. Half of the moon was out. It's just, we're in the middle of nowhere. It's awesome. This is um, one of my favorite types of parking situations because I have a motto. If you're in the middle of nowhere, or if you're, I even forgot my own motto. It's too early. Let's just start driving. We stopped at a, a, a truck stop and uh, we're all gonna shower but I gotta tell you guys I get hit up by a dude on my snapchat and he's like yo are you passing by Spokane and I was like hell yeah yo nice to meet you man thanks for coming out I saw your snapchat and I'm like oh yeah he's near Spokane he's gotta stop by yeah actually the boy the boys need a shower they're they're dirty super dirty right now I bet. Yeah. So, uh, anyways, uh, we're gonna catch up with this dude, and uh, we'll see if you want to sign the bus. I will. Hell yeah. I will. Right on. We're just catching up uh, with uh, Eli out here. He's uh, into uh, hiking and road trips, and uh, what, what, tell tell everybody what you were thinking about doing after high school. Getting a Sprinter van. Yeah. Or something like that. Yeah. A and then what? Living in it. There you go. Yeah, living in it. Yeah. There you go. High five for uh, the van life. Oh, Save heck, some yeah. money. Be smart. Oh, yeah. And uh, then he's gonna get himself, he's gonna get himself into law enforcement, I think. So, right on, man. You're a good dude. Thanks for coming out. Really appreciate it. <laughs> you got it. So you guys been hearing me talk about San Diego style Mexican food, so we're in Spokane and it's funny because the sign out there, actually backwards, you can see it says San Diego's best burritos. We're in Spokane, Washington, like what the heck? This is what's left over from my uh, breakfast burrito. I definitely ate way too much food, but you know who ate even more is this guy. I always eat a Every lot. Day. Three real tacos and uh, carne asada burrito. Yeah, Scale but, one to ten? Um, what do you rate it? Seven-ish. Seven. -ish. seven? And you had a I ate half of mine. It was a full size. Like they put everything in this burrito. It was really good. Yeah. Uh, it's like so good. Full. What do you think? One to ten. Uh, let's say a seven. Seven. Yeah. yeah. Pretty good, good value. You know, decent food. Not, not the best place, but it's still like you know, if you're out here in Spokane, cool, you know, it's man, probably the best thing. historic town of Wallace uh, spotted it from the freeway and uh, thought it was pretty charming and pretty cool looking check out all these old brick buildings this looks like a town from the gold rush days I feel like uh, some people would have uh, had some duels over here over some uh, mining claims and some gold there's gold in Dendar Hills about 27 miles west of Alberton, I think I saw. Check out this massive forest fire happening right next to the freeway. Uh, we just happened to notice it a few miles back and the closer and closer we get, the more and more intense it looks. So, uh, man, that's crazy. than the last update we're 
within miles of, of the flames, I would say. Uh, there's also a rest stop up here, looks like one mile up. Uh, the entire road is, is covered with smoke. Uh, you can start to see the flames, well not flames, but the smoke billowing up right above the flames over there. It's unreal. Uh, I don't know if I've ever been this close before. The whole air, it's terrible. I actually, I might, might need to borrow Josh's gas mask, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Thanks, bro. Guys, this uh, we passed what we thought was the fire, but this whole site right here is like singeing. So I don't know if this was on fire before and they put it out, but it's still going over here. It looks like it's still on fire. This, uh, smoke. It is uh, a couple hours after, well, a few hours after we spotted the second fire. Uh, we stopped in town, got a Jimmy John's sub, which by the way, first time and I ate one in the store and then I ordered another one to go. That's how good they are. If you guys haven't been, you gotta go. Uh, if you guys go, then you know what I'm talking about. So anyways, Jimmy John's, hit me up, wrap my bus. Uh, let's do this. Fill it full of subs. Need some fuel. Uh, oh, and I got a hammock. I'll show you the hammock later, but it's in uh, the bag from uh, Cabela's. Uh, so anyways, we're just driving, chilling. We've got a couple more hours to go. All right, we made it to uh, Bozeman, Montana. Uh, I'm super tired, driving all day. Kodu's on the roof. Oh. It's still smoky. I'll zoom in on the, that's the moon. You can't really see it, but just take my word for it. It's uh, it's rather orange. Um, Josh is throwing banana peels. <laughs> we had a couple snacks. Uh, that's it for today. We'll see you guys. <laughs> Fly bananas. <laughs> I'll see you guys some more, uh, tomorrow for more crazy antics. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment, and check out these crazy guys as well.